I was not expecting to be here. I was expected to be at the back trying to catch up with John. And when I came here, I realized that I have suddenly been promoted as the as the president of the function. Thank you very much, Dr. Kari. I came here for three reasons. One is nostalgia. The second is loyalty. And the third is curiosity. Nostalgia because anything connected with the UN, I am very nostalgic. Having spent 25 years in that building, it is very difficult to keep away from what is the United Nations. And loyalty because Dr. Karim, as you heard, was virtually my teacher, though he never taught me, he could have. And so when he called me, I said, I must go. The loyalty is also to John Samuel himself because in the last couple of years he has become a good friend. We met in virtual space first. We were together in an email group where we had all kinds of characters. And it didn't take me long to pick out the most important ones among them. And John was one of them. Because what he wrote, not only about international affairs, but also of matters relating to Kerala and the interface between international developments and Kerala's developments were fascinating. So we have communicated with each other and also have found a wealth of information and knowledge in him and the fact that he is now in the United Nations proper at the UNDP also adds to that loyalty. And the last is curiosity because when I got this invitation and read the title, Political Economy of Social Transitions and New Sectarianism in Kerala, the thought occurred to me was I wouldn't be able to say a single sentence on the subject. That was my thought. Because what is this all about? So I said I must go and listen to John Samuel. So these are the three reasons why I am here. I was not expecting to deliver a presidential address. But let me say how delighted I am that I am here today. And I have this opportunity to interact with uh, the foundation and also remember a very remarkable man called Mr. Bashir, whom I had no pleasure of meeting, but I, had, I was aware of his presence in the International Labour Organization when I used to go to Geneva. So he, I never had the opportunity to meet him, but the fact that uh, he is one of those who served abroad but then came back to Kerala and made a contribution. I have some kind of a sentimental linkage with him because I myself did that. I could have lived anywhere else in the world, but I chose to come to Kerala. And I think Mr. Bashir was also one of those who felt responsible enough or loyal enough to its state that he came back here. That way I can claim some spiritual brotherhood with him. So that also is a fact that attracted me to this evening. But more than anything else, let us look forward to